y'all. Welcome to Mixed Messages. I'm Claire Ward, and we are here to cheers to the Golden State. We're celebrating all things California by creating cocktails inspired by the cool ingredients found here, the rich culture, and of course, the breweries, wineries, and distilleries that make the booze. Today, we're making a cocktail we've all probably had at some point in our lives, the Tequila Sunrise. The modern version of this recipe was actually created in Sausalito, California. Entered famous cocktail lore when it was imbibed on by none other than Mick Jagger and the Rolling Stones. And of course, it picked up even more when the Eagles liked it so much they named a song after it. Just in the Fun fact, it was actually the first drink I actually put on my Instagram. I thought the colors and the layering were so pretty and I was so impressed by how cool this cocktail was. We're gonna make a grown up version of this drink. We're gonna incorporate some California ingredients and kind of turn it on its head a little bit. But it's super simple, don't be intimidated. You're gonna really enjoy this one. We're gonna update this recipe by balancing out the acidity a little bit so it's not too sweet. And instead of using grenadine, we're actually gonna use California red wine. It's gonna add a cool layering effect and elevate this cocktail just a little bit. First thing, this cocktail needs, of course, is fresh orange juice. Lucky for us, we live in California. Pick some fresh oranges from my backyard and we're gonna give them a juice. Now that we have all our ingredients prepped, let's make a cocktail. We're gonna use one and a half ounces of Reposado tequila. I'm gonna use Reposado because the vanilla notes that the barrel pulls out goes really well with the orange juice. We're gonna add one ounce of our freshly squeezed orange juice. We're gonna add one ounce of freshly squeezed lime. We're gonna add a half ounce of agave syrup. It's one to one agave and hot water stirred to combine. Then we're gonna fill our tin with ice. The more ice, the better. And we're gonna give it a shake. Our three shaking rolls. Shake with oomph for about three to five seconds and shake with rhythm. We're gonna strain this cocktail over fresh ice leaving just a little bit of room for our float. And then we're gonna to top with some California red wine. I'm gonna use Merlot. We're gonna pour nice and slowly so we get a pretty layering effect. And we are good to go. Isn't that pretty? It's got a fun like sangria, brunchy vibe going on, nice and citrusy. The notes from the reposado and the orange and the wine really come together to give you some toasty vanilla notes. Let's give it a sip. Ah, delicious. Thanks for watching Mixed Messages. Be sure to like this video or drop a comment below if you have any questions about this recipe or if there's a California ingredient you'd like to see featured on Mixed Messages. Thanks for watching and cheers, y'all.